Buffalo Bills Mafia, what's good? It's your boy, the executive director of film, Mr. Art Artie here, back with your 2023 NFL draft preview. Now, Buffalo, y'all have had some really, really, really good teams the past few years, man. Y'all are like this, like, like this close to getting Kansas City, man. This close. Y'all just need a few more pieces and to patch up a few holes in the ship. And I promise you, I promise you, me, Artie, Big Dookie is going to help y'all finally get them Chiefs, finally get that evil, wretched Patrick Mahomes and get back to the Super Bowl so y'all can finally win one because um, y'all have the team to do it. You have the quarterback to do it. So let's let's just get right into it. Let's. I'm excited for this. Let's see what we can do to help the Buffalo Bills, help Bills Mafia get to where they need to be. Playing this game, but you have to take it week by week, and this is week one. Josh hands it off. No, keeps it. Rolls to his right. Fires a man wide open. It is caught. It is caught by Davis. Runs into the end zone. Touchdown, Buffalo. Looks to throw. Fires caught by Isaiah McKenzie. Fights his way into the end zone. Touchdown, Buffalo. Who's going to make a play? Allen taking off. Can he get there? Stiff arm to get there. First down. Josh looks to his left. Pumps once. Now he's going to keep it. He's going to run. He's inside the five. He tries to stretch into the end zone. He is in. Everybody got his help but me. Hey, coach. Can I get involved? Gets out of pressure. Runs to his right. Throws it downfield looking for Diggs. Diggs stops and he makes the catch and he's in the end zone. Touchdown, Buffalo. Bills Mafia was good. It's your boy, the executive director of film. Mr. Art already here. Back with you guys. It's 2023 NFL Draft Preview. As you can see with the first pick in you guys' mock draft, we got you Jordan Addison, wide receiver from USC. I'll be breaking down some film on him in a second. Guys got Joe Tipman, interior offensive lineman from Wisconsin, a dang good player. Another interior defensive lineman in Barry Young, a dang good player. Um, developmental piece in Dylan Horton, edge from TCU. Uh, Noah Sewell, solid linebacker depth and a potential H-back alert. And Evan Hole um, from Northwestern. So, yeah, man. You guys are looking pretty good with this draft. Um, like I said, um, I'm going to really touch on Jordan Addison because receiver is a sneaky need for y'all. You guys have been in the market trying to get someone like maybe DeAndre Hopkins or Odell Beckham and really round out that receiving core with Gabe Davis and Stephon uh, Diggs. Um, I think Jordan Addison can really, really help there. Um, I also think that re-fortifying that interior offensive line with Joe Tipman is a really good pick as well. And I um, really like that Byron Young pick um, in the third round. Like I said, we're going to focus in on Jordan Addison right here. Now, who is Jordan Addison? Jordan Addison is the wide receiver from USC. And what you're going to get out of Jordan Addison is route running. Um, this is a young man who knows how to pick him up and rope him down. And the way I describe it, he knows how to twerk people out. <laughs> really, really, really light frame, but don't let it fool you. Um, he can run by you. He can run by you pretty quickly. Um, his athletic testing at the at the combine doesn't say that, but I've seen him run by plenty of people on tape that ran fast at the combine. So. Yeah, uh, it's, it's it's it was simply just he had a back issue going on with the combines. That's why the numbers look you know. But trust me, you cut on that Stanford tape right here, and he runs past corners like three times <laughs> with ease. So yeah, with Addison, man, um, really really sure hands. I personally believe he's the best receiver in this class. I don't know why people have him like falling out of the first round, back of the first round. I don't know how he made it to the, you guys' pick when you mock, that's mocked, but oh well. Um, but yeah, man, like Jordan Addison, you get him into Buffalo, into Bills Mafia. I really think he can take you guys' offense to the next level because now you have the three people you have to worry about. It's almost a pick like getting Jordan Addison for you guys is almost like think of the Cowboys getting CeeDee Lamb in 2020. 
when we had Amari Cooper and Michael Gallup already, it's like that's just icing on the cake. So yeah, Bills Mafia. Hope you enjoyed it. And um good luck to you guys the rest of the way. <laughs>